Here we go. Sounds good. Ailey, Mark. Ready and action, Terry. Ready and now. <laughs> We're tapping into our inner ape. What does that mean? That's what we call it. <laughs> That's what it's, ma these things it's, make you. It's an ape. shedding what makes us human and dropping into the deeper animals that we are. That's really what it is. One action. We did do a lot of research on apes, and, and you know, I got to play with a couple apes and really get to hold them and feel them and see what their energy is like. And, um, and it's, it's more about just dropping into yourself and seeing out and just allowing yourself to be really open and vulnerable and, and, and feel everything, sort of like going so back into your instincts. It looks like you just regressed about two million years. <laughs> you just got to let yourself scale. go there. Yeah, you let yourself go there. It's so free. It's soft, and circular, and round, and economic. I'm not using any muscles, just like the eights. So. It's all about sitting and breathing, and actually just softening the mind. It's really what it is, because we're so. I find that we're so driven by our heads, you know, as humans. It, when you just sort of soften it. it actually you see better you see clearer um, and you you, you you just lose the chatter there's a lot of chatter you know that we wow. have and if you quiet the chatter you, you tend to drop into yourself a little more and you can see wider and it's it's weird it's a weird it's like can you it's ever weird. look at apes the same way no no when you look at when you when you when you look into apes I mean they're so close to us. They're just so close to us. Yeah. They're just so similar. We're so, we're so similar in so many ways that um, I think we have a lot to learn from them. Apes do not want war.